Hello, Craig Birch here from Seconds Out. I have here a big chunk of the Leicester contingent on the Box Nation show at the Leicester Arena on Saturday night. On the left, I have CJ Challenger. On the middle, I have Jermaine Smile. On the right, they stopped gassing Leon Woodstock, who's going for the Midlands title. Jermaine's defending his English title. CJ is obviously got. You got Danny Little, I think. Danny Little, yeah, yeah, that's Okay, okay. So, boys, our guests are so excited to be on this massive show. I'm excited, man. I know, I always bring me on That's why I stand at the back. Energy, right? oh, so say, I've never seen anybody in Leicester wear a dicky bow like that before. Listen, <laughs> so, so. ain't no one could wear anything like that, can't wear it. Yeah. <laughs> I, I certainly haven't seen any of them in Beaumont Lose, I can tell you that. <laughs> <laughs> so, Definitely not. <laughs> okay, so boy, <laughs> CJ, just start with you a little bit. You are in the. Have you boxed again since you boxed in Dudley? In Dudley, no, no, this is my third fight. I was supposed to box in um, March in yeah. Corby. Um, that fell through. Yeah, yeah. So we'd yeah. already started kicking on for that, and then the opportunity came up for this, and uh, just gonna seize the moment, grab it with both hands, and we'll see what we'll see what we produce. Of course, because it was funny that because I saw you boxing Dudley and so, and I said he reminds me of Tyro Nurse, the nurse yeah, yeah, yeah. defending the British and so yeah. on, isn't it? So, yeah. It's yeah. funny, you know, because a lot of people have likened me to Tyro Nurse, and then next thing you know, we're boxing on the same show, so. We'll be able to see it in the live in the flesh. Of we'll course. See the comparison live in the flesh. Yeah, of course, of course. Leon, you've got a shot at the yeah. Midlands Super Featherweight title, I yeah. believe, against Paul Holt, the yeah. uh, <laughs> against Paul Holt, the Brummie. That title's now vacant, I think, because Holt couldn't fight Sambo or something like I that. Know, I keep hearing all, I don't even know. All I know is I'm getting a belt. Yeah, yeah. So you're not really. Does anything Holt bring phase you at all? And yeah, so on? He's, he's yeah. Gonna, his style and everything that he brings is going to make this fight like something to watch, definitely. If he brings what he has, then it's going to be a great fight. So it all depends on like how, what, what he brings to the table, do you get what I'm saying? Cause yeah. I know what I'm going to go there to do. I know what I'm there, what my job is. I know what I'm there to do. So what he brings would, def de would define what happens with the fight, do you get what I'm saying? I, I believe it, it has the potential to be a very exciting fight. Okay, do you think he's going to go to distance or are you going to get him out of there before? See what he's happens hot, on the night. He's you know? See what happens on the night. See what happens on the night. Of course, of course, of course. <laughs> Keeping his powder dry, I believe the term is. In the middle, Jermaine. Jermaine, you've got Darryl Williams. That's a tough fight and so on. There was a bit of trash talk in the press conference we just had. A poor old Jermaine couldn't get a word in edgeways. But <laughs> his coat, it's good, that's the thing. So, but obviously, you know, is that part of the plan to sort of get in Daryl's head a little bit, or are you just sort of t staying out of it and doing concentrating on your own business? I, I guess. Concentrating so. on my own fight. I mean, like, um, like I say, I think I don't think we need to wind him up. I think he's the only one that's helpful. Yeah. Not yeah. Me. So, um, yeah, just, just, just it's going to be You're a great fight. You're quite a cool guy, though. Yeah, yeah. You don't need to. I'm quite. I don't need to do that. I'm saying, let my fist do the talking when I get in there Saturday. We'll see how we come through. Higher, higher class, higher, higher level opponent of, of, of an opponent. Of course, of course. Well, it's worth talking about your journey with Leon McKenzie. You know, maybe you were even a slight underdog in that. I suppose, or you know, you've taken names before and beaten them. Mm. Yeah, you've yeah. taken the rows and stuff like that. So, is it, is, is it that never say day I attitude? You know, you've had defeats and so on. You've had to bounce back and so on. And I suppose that's what's made you a champion, I guess. Yeah, isn't it? yeah so. you know. Unbeaten fighter don't, don't phase me, to be honest with you. Um, I mean, I've, I've, I've come across a few unbeaten fighters, took those. I mean, that's what we do, isn't it? You know what I mean? So, it's so, all so good, man. That's what we do. I mean. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's what we do. Okay, okay, so I guess a complete, a clean sweep for the Leicester corner would be, a, you know, the perfect perfect Saturday night for the result, wouldn't it? Yeah. So, <laughs> but it, it, they know it's called for City of Champions. City of exactly. Champions. Yeah. Cool, yeah, so, yeah. You better get in there quickly with this show before we have to have the Premier League title. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Well, yeah, clean sweep on me aim for nothing less. You yeah, know? For real. we all graft. Yeah. Then we'll have Paige as well. Exactly. Up in uh, where? Where's she fighting? Uh, Paige, Sheffield. where you fighting? Sheffield. Chef. Yeah, yeah. Chef, oh, Paige, wow. Attention. Oh yeah, we've got, yeah. We've got I think as well. Um, what's his name? The elites, isn't it? Oh, it's the elites. Exactly. Yeah. So we're doing bits, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's do yeah. that here. Let's do 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 that Timing is everything. Yeah, yeah. you know. Yeah. I, I think honestly, people are sleeping on the fact that Leicester are a big sporting city. Yeah, they are, yeah. They really are, and like I can slowly see it now coming up. Do you know what I mean? Like with people, like the younger generation, especially like you got Harry. Do you know what I mean? That like, yeah. guy, he's coming through in the left, like with the Leicester football and that. And I can just see it everywhere. Do you know what I mean? Like the next few years are going to be very interesting in regards to Leicester. Of definitely, course, of definitely. course, and obviously what we want to see is big shows back at the Leicester Arena each and every time. I guess now. Yeah. Yeah, man. Yeah. Yeah, that's been the dream for a long time, man. Me and my coach, we spoke about it in the amateurs. We're going to bring boxing back to Leicester. No one believed us. And look, we're here. Frank Warren's here. Box Nation are here. BT Sports are here. We're here. You know what I'm saying? Like, 
Yo, I dread to think how Larry your suits are going to get Leon if you saw it. You, you know what? You know, before, 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 literally before I got here, I was talking to my coach's son Jay. Like, I'm, I need to get a couple more suits. Like, some nice ones. <laughs> real, real nice ones, man. What a Union Jack like Frank Maloney or something, bro. Yeah, man. Listen, <laughs> man's going to be that like, 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 Frank Maloney. Oh yeah, I'll say it. Man. The artist should probably know this track below yeah, yeah, yeah. so. <laughs> Okay, so I guess just watch this space and watch the, the boxing scene in Leicester, watch I guess. This, yeah, man. So. Watch it, watch it. We're coming. Both your eyes. Yeah. <laughs> okay, excellent, fantastic. Best of luck, Saturday boys, and see you next time. Thank you very much.